Hello guys, greetings from me to you. It's your girl again, Julie Yams. I travel salute to all my returning subscribers and my view, new viewers. If today is the first time of you watching my channel, I thank you very much. And may God bless you. May you keep coming to watch my channel. What did I carry can give us here today be safe? Now the video when they go viral for internet, it just they go waka waka for TikTok. They waka for Facebook. They waka for everywhere. About our Nigeria Airport Authority officials, when they misbehave for airport, there is this lady when he post one video when he did for TikTok, how she visited Nigeria for the first time, how our Nigeria Airport officials take the disgrace themselves, not be the lady that they disgrace. Now they are that they disgrace. Then they ask this lady for COVID-19 test, which she don't do. She showed them the barcode. Normally, as you do the test, now code they go give you. So when she got to the airport, she was showing them the code. They refused to look at the code. They refused to take the COVID-19 test from her. Rather, then they tell her, say, where she forgot to do the COVID-19 test, not be there, she's supposed to do one. Say she's supposed to do one for their own place when they tell her. So the lady, they say, no, he don't check, he check internet. Now the recommended place when government say make them do this COVID-19 test, now there she for do one. Now the certified place when government say make them do the test, now there she for do one. But these people, because say they want bribe, they don't want to listen to this lady. They begin to push them up and down, they ask for money. To the extent, one of the officials come call the husband aside. They tell the husband, say, bring 25,000 naira. We will let your wife board this plane. If you not bring that money, she go miss her flight. So this lady refused because she know her right. Say she do the right thing. Why she will come pay extra 25,000? Now make me bring this to recall here. It's no good. This kind of thing when we they do. They know us for us. I say now only Yahoo Yahoo we sabi. Now only for one night we sabi. Now so so why you we be. Our country na corrupt country. Then they go still come, come for the country. Una no go disappoint them. Una go really show na self to them. Say yes. Now inside corruption we for the swim. Now we for the bath. Now we for the eat. How can you do that to a foreigner? You go do one to your own citizen when it's no good. You go still do one to a foreigner when he come visit. This kind of thing, it's no good because this lady go go out. Now the impression when she gets about Nigeria, that's what she go to tell every, everybody. And that now waiting they happen right now because it they on TikTok, it they on everywhere. The lady say no go let this matter rest because it go disgrace every Nigeria or um, not be everyone. It go disgrace these Nigeria officials when do this thing to her. So my people, I beg, when they work for airport, make when they do a job. Make una they do na job. And I tell my people, make una share this video. Make it work so that it go reach the right people, the right authority. When go fit take action against these people when do this kind of thing. Make them not they give us bad name. We don't get enough bad name. We don't want to increase that. Now how we go tell they change the bad name? Now we they do, now we they ask for. The other day, somebody they show video, video for, for, for Instagram. They tell the one Uber driver. Some they not carry those guys. He even video the guy, they show the guy. Some they not carry a more. The guy, they pose like passengers for near airport say the guy in an airport official now this tax force when they put say maybe they catch people when they carry passengers along the road can you imagine that i know if you understand they put on us make they catch people when they carry people along the road now uber drivers and uh, taxi drivers no they carry people again because they don't understand say government say make they know they do one now una con they lure the people make it carry una. now now we be the tax force now now go come go stand for the for the wrong place con they call uber driver Driver. Come call Uber driver for phone. Come stand for the wrong place. Come tell Uber driver, say, make it they come. Say you stand for here, make it come pick you. As the Uber driver go say, make it they pick you now, they go arrest the Uber driver. Which kind of be this one? Which kind of country be this one? You won't be the one when the day authority when you supposed to to, to, to bring law and order. Now you even they cause confusion. Now you they cause problem. The offense when the Uber driver won't commit, not be you yourself commit because you yourself stand there. This kind thing no good. I bet make una share this video. This official, they don't disgrace una self. Now una self una disgrace. Una not disgrace me because una face now they for TikTok. Una face they for Instagram. Una face they for Facebook. Una face go see enter YouTube. Me, I go put her for YouTube. Make everybody they see una. Disgraceful and one thing when I want advice our people if they, they ask una for bribe make una not just they give bribe make una they ask for their ogre every every officers get in your guy if you not agree show you ogre leave and go ask another person even if that ogre said now still part of the thief thief in the city they ask for bribe 
As for that Oga Oga, every Oga gets his own superior officer. To the extent you go get to the right person when you go and school for bribe. Now, so we go to do one. One, that's much more. I know, say, it no go easy. They go waste your time. But one time, one time, one time, one time, it go become big thing. So make we start to do And kudos to this lady. Now, so we are supposed to behave the way this lady behaved. She refused to give in to the bri bribery and she succeeded. Now, so we go to do We go to the video there. And I want to advise our government official. Make them put camera, video camera for airport every angle. Make them put somebody when you go to watch this cam uh, video camera every day at the end of the day or the next day so that all these of officers when they misbehave make them they call them to order make them not they disgrace us our international airport i beg that's why i go talk and reach thank you everyone thank you for coming to watch my channel god bless you all my returning subscribers and my new subscribers god bless you and bless you my viewers see you on my next video bye hey queens so it's your girl alina so i wanted to come on here and make a video about the airport and how it traumatized a lot of foreigners that come in into the lagos nigeria airport so unfortunately this video would be done in parts because there's so much we need to talk about so let's talk about the first thing i'm going to talk about the first time i've ever came into the airport in lagos nigeria and i'm going to talk about the last time that i left so when you're coming from america or any foreign place into nigeria automatically they think you're rich and because their government is so corrupt to the people and they don't care about the people the people see you and not all people in nigeria and i'm not saying this disclaimer this is not every worker in the airport this is not everybody in the nigerian airport so when i came into the airport in december of 2020 it was my first time ever being into africa and my first time being into nigeria and i was super excited to go and be with my husband and his family in this new country of nigeria so when i came into the country and into the airport one of the first things i noticed is that the workers looked at you and prayed on you as if you're a person and an opportunity for extra money so when you enter in yes there's certain policies and there's certain procedures and papers that you need to have but a lot of times they would lie about those papers for example they will lie about the seven day COVID, stating that you have to have it already paid before you enter the country and that is not true as long as you have made your appointment you can make the payment at the facility that you choose to have your COVID test that was one of the lies that they tried to get extra money out of me anything to do with any of your paper immunizations i want you before you come into the nigeria is to make sure that all your paperwork is correct all your immunizations is correct make sure everything has been crossed and dotted so in stating so when i went on the portal the nigerian portal and i would list that site i made sure that i had made an appointment for my seven day COVID test. I did not pay for it, but I had the barcode and a scanner. And because I did not pay for it, and I don't have to pay for it at the time, I could pay for it when I go to the facility. The young lady said to me, and she asked me for a bribe in order for me to enter the country. Knowing that I paid a lot of money to get there, that hmm, maybe another 20 to $50 more, I'm gonna give it to her because after paying all these thousands of dollars and I made it this far, Hey Queens, part two about exposing the Nigerian Lagos airport. So firstly, what you should know is that your significant other is not allowed to enter in to the airport to help you with bags, to help you check in, to help you understand the language. And the reason why they do that is so therefore they can take advantage of you and take advantage of the situation and lie to you about your paperwork. I've even heard of cases where guys had to bribe their way in just to say goodbye to their loved one, their wives, or their families and children. They had to pay the person that was standing at the door just to come in to help. 
So now I'm gonna talk about when I left this year in 2021. You see the man that's standing next to my husband with the black mask on? My husband is the one in the orange. My husband actually had to sneak into the airport to help me because when I first got into the airport, the first thing out of their mouth when I showed them my piece of paper 